world one community hey check this out man this is for the western world one finance and world investing one all right now i just want to just dive into this i meant to do this yesterday but um you know time caught up with me i'm gonna be real real quick with it hopefully <laughs> don't forget to like share subscribe follow and go to that uh facebook like it man the fan page western world one all of it when it pulls up just like them all man you know all right anyway uh this is about chicago man governor jb prickster man this boy here man is a fool all right i want to know what y'all think about this some republic democratic stuff going on or whatever about the taxes me personally i just feel like man why are we paying taxes anyway <laughs> but okay but i want to know y'all thoughts on this okay let's go as a fair tax amendment vote approaches some republicans accuse the governor for intimidation ain't that something illinois is one of the only eight states with a flat tax i didn't know that let's see if i can play this real quick maybe this might save me let's see now i talk about the 10 it don't but let's see if it play for me uh oh it's loading y'all let's see if it play let's see if it play Up, ah, link broke anyway Let's get it. All right. Some Republicans are accusing Governor J.B. Prickster of intimidation uh, as Election Day and vote on the proposed fair tax amendment approaches. The ballot questions to allow the state to adopt a graduate tax instead of a flat tax there is now has dominate the airwaves. Now, y'all know what a graduate tax is and the difference between flat rate right graduate just means like whatever your tax bracket is that's when it should increase uh whatever bracket that you in that's when you that's that's how your taxes go and other than whatever the flat rate is no matter how much you make this is your flat rate taxes and again me i, I you know me i propose no no taxes at all i'm sorry okay all right advertise blitz over illinois okay okay advertise blitz over illinois progress tax voters kick off Prixer's donation. Okay, there's something else. Governor J.B. Prixer proposed the amendment and has spent millions of dollars of his own money to support it with a huge budget defect, uh, defected combined with COVID-19 expenses. Prixer said if the state does not shift from a flat tax to graduate tax based on income, residents could face an across the board income tax hike of 20% or a 15% cut in government in government service. Oh, wow. So so 20% or 15% could be cut in the government services. A lot of it's still being cut anyway. The best direction we should go to deal with this is to make sure we are asking those most able to step up and pay. The wealthiest in state, Prixer said, Governor J.B. Prixer donated $51.5 million more dollars for tax in, uh, initiatives. Wow. I didn't know that. Under Prixer's proposal plan, single and joint fillers with income above two hundred fifty thousand would pay three percent more in taxes, seven point seven five percent. If you make two hundred fifty um to five hundred thousand, seven point eighty five percent if you make more than five hundred thousand to a million a year, and seven point ninety nine percent if you file a joint return and have a net income more than uh is that a million dollars uh a hundred thousand i'm sorry uh the current flat rate is 4.95 percent all right the state has created an a fair tax calculator so you can see how much your tax will change based on your income filing status and other considerations like dependents and military states uh status Illinois billionaire Governor Prixers Ken Griffey fight over the state proposal graduate tax amendment. State Republican leaders said the 20 percent increase option is nothing but a scare tactics for voters. I want the governor to explain why they are using intimidation. The scare tactics with Illinois citizens and voters today, said House of Republican leader Jim Durkin. Governor Prixer said it's not intimidation, it's reality concerning the state's finances. Uh, Governor Prixer, uh, what's a confidence? What do you say? Oh, I'm sorry. Illinois Governor J.B. Prixer is confided in his fair income tax plan would pass as he marched 100 days in office. 
Okay, so I'm see what, what, I, what I was just getting confused at was um, I'm thinking that these are commercials when they, you know, when they different in different colors. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna continue. Republicans argue that if the amendment passes, it will open the door to Democrats to continue raising taxes in the years to come. Whoa, a a vote yes on this graduate income tax is really handling Democrats in a blank check. Um, uh, sorry, handing Democrats a blank check, said Deputy. Uh, minority leader uh, Tom Dimmer. But the General Assembly already has the power to raise taxes. And Prixer said the amendment contains no languages changing the power that they are already that they already have. All right. It does not give new powers to the legislator, but about taxation, he said, uh, for an amendment to be added or changed in the Illinois Constitution, it must be approved by 60 percent of the people voting on the question or a simple majority, 50 percent plus one and all the people voting in the election. All right. So what do y'all think, man? Um, you know, y'all could go check this out here, man. I'm bringing this awareness to my people, man, my community, Western World One, uh, Western World One Finance, because, man, we do have to get on top of this, too, as well. Um, I didn't even know nothing about this. <clears throat> and so I was reading. So I was like, I might as well just share this with my crew. All right. But let me know y'all thoughts, man. Um, what y'all think about it? Do y'all think we should have graduate taxes or do you think you should just keep it at a flat rate no matter how much you make? Or do you just don't want no taxes, period? Because I don't. I'm tired of paying taxes. Anytime I it's, it's violating the government, the government funding or whatever. Man, I already took down the basketball rim, so I don't know what to tell y'all. All right, anyway, let me know y'all thoughts, man. What's the world want out?